My name is Alberto Cuoci and um, I come from Politecnico di Milano in Italy uh, where uh, uh, I teach uh, chemical reaction engineering and uh, computational fluid dynamics of reacting flows. My first time here in uh, Sharif University and uh, in uh, Iran more in general and so I'm very pleased to, <laughs> to be here for the first time. I'm Sini Sadiki. I am professor at the Technical University of Darmstadt in Germany. At the moment I am also dean of uh, study in the um, in mechanics. It is the first time to be here. Uh, it is in this framework of uh, combustion school, Zama School organized here, because I am also really involved in the uh, combustion research, especially in uh, spray combustion so they invite me to be here and it is, was a pleasure for me to accept. My name is Giancarlo Sorrentino. I am um, assistant professor at the University of Naples in south part of Italy. I am in the department of uh, chemical material and production engineering. Uh, I was in connection with, with many uh, students uh, from Sharif University uh, in Politecnico di Milano and in particular I had I had the pleasure to uh, be the advisor of uh, a PhD student uh, coming from this uh, university. And I uh, have to say that I have a very good uh, impression from uh, students coming from the university, a very, very good background uh, of uh, equipment uh, they, uh, they have. and. Uh, uh, the type of experimental measurements they can carry out. So uh, I think uh, if uh, they uh, increase, uh, my colleagues here in uh, uh, Sharif University, if they are able to increase their uh, participation to international events like uh, conferences, international conferences, to better ad advertise uh, the equipment and uh, the possibility to get experimental data they have here, uh, I think they can uh, uh, for sure improve their uh, visibility in the rest of the world and uh, improve the quality of their research activity uh, here. I had PhD students in Darmstadt from this university. I can say uh, three or four <coughs> and one postdoc. So they are really good students. They have, uh, they had, uh, or they have perhaps up to now, a uh, very good background and they work very hard and I think uh, these qualities are what we want to have as a researcher. And in contact with our, some colleagues here, I see that they do very good researches and uh, yesterday we visit some labs and uh, the, the quality is okay, but it can be improved. And perhaps during this uh, joint collabor this joint project, we can also help a little bit, and uh, this synergy effect can be exploited in the future. But there is an agreement between Technical University of Darmstadt and Sharif University. We will try to um, to enhance this collaboration by uh, initiating joint project. The last days are very good because the student try now to be active and uh, we see that uh, they understand well what we are uh, providing and um, the um, question they put are really um, the state of the art and I feel very good for the quality of uh, the students during the Zoma School, yes. The Zoma School is very good because uh, we get, uh, you get also some uh, international rec recognized, so, uh, expert. And the students have this possibility to, the opportunity to discuss with them, to interact. There was not a possibility to be involved in uh, cooperation or joint projects, but I would like to do that in the future. We had some exchange, some ideas about the possible framework 
uh, with a couple of professors that are uh, in the aerospace department. And therefore, I would like in the future, if it's possible, to do that. Um, and therefore, to uh, try to collaborate by means of joint projects or uh, other kind of framework. I liked a lot this experience. It was my first summer school uh, as a lecturer. It was a good experience for me because I had the opportunity to uh, understand which is uh, the way uh, I can communicate uh, to other to students of other uh, countries, uh, which are their feedback. How can I improve also my uh, my my lectures? Yesterday we saw some laboratories. I saw that the infrastructures are very good. So um, I can say that people work a lot here, and of course there is a strong collaboration between students, PhD, professor, and uh, it's a good cooperation. I saw a lot of experiments. I saw a lot of uh, very good idea, very good uh, projects. So I think that the research level is very good. Uh, also the level of professors that I met. Uh, also the quality of research is very good. and. Uh, of course, they can be improved. Uh, uh, this morning, in particular, I went to the Grand Bazaar, and uh, it was really exciting. I've never been in a place like uh, this, so crowded. So uh, it was very, very uh, nice because there were uh, people, Iranian, really <laughs> Iranian people, and so uh, it's, it was an interesting experience. Uh, uh, for me to better know your culture and uh, to better understand the differences that uh, uh, we, you have with respect to <laughs> our lifestyle and so on, and so on. yes. I mean, the organizers were uh, amazing, they were very kind uh, to me, very warm. I didn't ex expect, honestly, uh, that people were, uh, are so friendly. And so this, is, was, this was a real su surprise to me, a nice surprise to me. So, uh, thank you. <laughs> I liked a lot the city. It's uh, huge, a lot of people, a lot of cars. Uh, the traffic impressed me, but I like the city. It's uh, a very, it's a live city. But the people are very kind. Also, if I am uh, European, uh, they are very kind. They are, uh, they smile. Uh, Tehran is a big city, very big. I feel it very, very good, and the restaurant were very nice and uh, the people are are very kind and uh, i think i can come back i thank you for giving me the opportunity to give this impression and perhaps in the future you will be here and i will be there من مسعود دربندی استاد دانشکده هوافضای دانشگاه صنعتی شریف هستم من حدود چند سالی هستش که مدیر قطب علمی سامانه های هوافضای کشور هستم در مدرسه های بین المللی هدف این هستش که افراد برجسته از اقصا نقاط کشور گرد هم بیاریم و جمعشون کنیم بیاریم داخل در واقع ایران و در داخل یه رویدادی و در اونجا علاقه مندان به اون دانش رو هم جمع بکنیم و اونها دوره های کوتاه مدت آموزشی بزنن و سطوح دانشی در واقع علاقه مندان رو افزایش بدن خوشبختانه با توجه به حسن شهرتی که دانشگاه صنعتی شریف داره و اساتید برجسته ای داره و فعالیت های پژوهشی چشمگیری که در زمینه احتراق انجام داده ما تونستیم در کوتاه ترین زمان ممکن کمتر از یک ماه پاسخ مثبت به دعوت خودمون رو از بسیاری از افراد برجسته در زمینه احتراق در دنیا کسب بکنیم که نهایتا تعداد چهار 
نفر از اساتید برجسته از کشورهای انگلیس، آلمان و ایتالیا انتخاب شدند که بسیار حیف استش که ما با توجه به برجستگی که دانشگاه صنعتی شریف داره و شناختی که دانشگاه ها دنیا از این دانشگاه ما دارن ما ارتباط بین المللی خودمون رو نتونیم تقویت بکنیم من امیدوار هستم که با حمایت ریاست دانشگاه و مسئولین امور بین المدر و طبیعتا ارکان مختلف دانشگاه نه تنها برای مدرسه احتراق ایران که امسال برگزار شد و امسالیم در سالهای دیگه هم برگزار بشه متشابه این روی داد در دانشگاه های دیگه هم برگزار بشه و انشالله سمره اون رو در طی سالهای آینده به صورت بهتر شدن رنکینگ دانشگاه هم ببینیم